Every year, we read stories in the papers of how the number of students studying science has dropped. So if you're a teacher, how on earth do you drum up enthusiasm among your very young charges for astrophysics? <laughs> Tall order, but not for our next winner, our National Teacher of the Year. The International Space Station, orbiting 220 miles above the Earth. Neston Primary School in Wiltshire, a school that has gone where no other school has gone before. My name is Rebecca. What do you do in the spacecraft? Over. Hello, They're the first British primary school children to talk to space, linking up with astronauts on board the International Space Station. The atmosphere is absolutely electric. At the end of it, a lot of people in the hall were actually crying. But masterminding a place in the history books wasn't enough for head teacher Linda Davis. The children were so enthused that she set about campaigning yet again and eventually won funding for another first, their very own moon base. A center for science and technology where the children can learn and be inspired. We wanted something that would be a lasting memory of that link-up with the International Space Station. Linda wanted to make science come alive, to make it real and exciting for the children. I think the moon base is really, really good because we can um, contact it from all the classrooms here. I think it's just a really nice place to play as well, actually. Wow. It's just amazing. And we're very lucky. Neston Primary School was once described by Ofsted as having serious weaknesses, but today it's considered outstanding. Linda's creativity and inspirational leadership have meant morale is up, results are up, and of course, science grades have rocketed. Who likes science? <laughs> I know that you want to say uh, a few words to people. I do. I, I really want to say I've got the most superb staff, parents, governors, children. It's just amazing. It's, it's a wonderful school. Well, there are some people here tonight who would want to say congratulations to you personally. Now, on any other day, you'd know them as your pupils. But tonight, they are the intrepid crew of the <laughs> Neston Starship Enterprise. to present you with your award. Yeah. Oh yeah, you've forgotten <laughs> about that bit, haven't you? Uh, you better to do that than a man who's not just flown across the world to be here, but who has also travelled almost 10 million miles around the Earth as well on the International Space Station. He is British, he is a real astronaut. Please give a huge welcome to Piers Sellers. <laughs> Now, Piers, you've got the award here. I do. Uh, Linda, I'm in awe of all teachers. You, you're the people who shape the future. You're the people who determine what the next generation will do. So on behalf of all us reformed pupils <laughs> and current space crews and future space crews, this award's for you. Thanks for everything you do. 